Hello everybody and good day to you all. Today I'm talking about Talking Dagger season number one and se season number one, episode number one and episode number two. Episode number one is First Flight. Episode number two is Suicide um, Sprint. Episode number one was directed by Gina Prince um, um, Bethelwood. And the episode number two is directed by Alex Garcia Lopez. Now, I'm pretty much putting them all together as just one. Okay, we now we, this is this episode here. We get an introduction to some um, Tyrone and Tandy. You get to see how they um, first met, how their powers got triggered, and where they are now. And you got you see you see Tandy who started off in a nice home, nice family, a nice wealthy. Not, I'm gonna say I won't say rich, but they were well off. And her dad, her dad had a nice job. And he was some type of engineer or something like that, working for Roxxon. And it looks like, well, he's a little bit of a workaholic. A little bit of a workaholic, even though, because cause his daughter was at, at, at um, her dance um, rehearsal for ballet. And she had to stand outside in the rain wait, waiting for him, because she knew her mom wasn't going to come, because it seemed like her mom at this time was on pills. It looked like a, a while ago, her mom got hurt, or maybe her back, or something like that. And she took some pain pills for the for the problem, and because, but... Through that, she became addicted, and the next thing you know, now she's just popping pills for everything. And so she's home, a little bit drug out, and she knows she can't call on her, but she calls on her dad, and her dad shows up, and they have an accident, and and, and then that, but at, at the same time, it's going now. You got Tyrone with his with his brother, and his brother was going, his brother, um, his friends wanted them to steal some radio. His brother didn't want to do it, and Tyrone wanted to be just like his brother, full as though he was, he'll steal it for him to, to to impress his brother. And well, the cops show up. His brother gets killed. He dives in the water after him. And then, the, and, and then you got Tandy and her father. They, they get into a car accident. We make them go in the water. And then something happens in the water, like some explosion happens when the, when the rock sign, um drilling thing, whatever, collapses, cause something to explode in the water. They get hit by it, and next thing you know, they got powers. He ends up transporting to her, saving her life, getting her to shore. And that's their first meeting. And she ended up taking his hoodie, which she keeps for her whole life. And he, he ended up taking her shoe. So they're, they're connected to, to each other, but they don't even know if they don't, they don't even know each other at the same time, too. Yes. And you get to see their first meeting, which is not really a pleasant one, because she tried to well, steal from him. And that, and that activates their powers for the first time, which freaks, freaks, freaks them both out. And so you see the powers getting used in, in the, both of these episodes here. And, 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 and they're not exactly sure what's going on. You got Tyrone teleporting her everywhere. And he teleport and the thing is though, he teleported to the to the cop who killed his brother. The, who to well, the police covered up and trying to make it seem like he was lying and the, the cop he was talking about never existed. And you got Tandy, whose life got messed up by Rexon. She's pretty much like her mom is on drugs. She's sleeping around with a lot of different men. Tandy doesn't want to be around that, so she pretty much she sleeps by herself in this abandoned church. And she also has a boyfriend who she helps who she who helps her run scams. This episode is very interesting. I mean, it's different from the from the comic book completely. Different take on it altogether. But there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, a lot of the TV shows and movies and that's what that change from the comic book. But this, but 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 it still feels closely like like them, and I really do enjoy this new take on these characters. It makes you, I, I really want to know more about their lives and what their powers are, and how, how they're going to connect to become cloak and dagger. Which direction they, they're going to go? And most likely, the bad guy right now is, is mostly mostly like rocks on the company because because it because it, 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 it connects them both, and, and because of their powers and what happened to rocks on, they're connected. It's all connected, and so watching and watching this whole world, especially now that it's, it's in New Orleans, and see how, how they get incorporated inside the inside the show and their lives is also very interesting at the same time too. So first two episodes, great, really did enjoy them. Um, I I enjoyed the chemistry between um Tyrone and um Tandy, and Tyrone played by um R. B. Joseph, and you got Tandy played by Olivia Holt. And I really do enjoy them on screen. Even though she was trying to scam him and rob him, 
the chemistry that they did have was quite nice. And it looks like Tyrone was about to get a, a girlfriend sort of in this episode, in this episode here. But at the same time, even though the girl who plays his girlfriend is nice and I really do like her, I don't still feel the same chemistry that he had with Tandy. Even though it was like a short moment or two, and it wasn't a great one, I still did enjoy it watching them together. Maybe because I don't know how they're going to be in the convos. Maybe that could be a little bit in my brain. But watching them on screen, I, I really did enjoy their chemistry. It looked like they, they, they do get along quite well. So, for, for two episodes, I'm in. I'm on board. I want to see where this is going to go. I want to see this whole world. Hopefully, they get, they get, get their powers down and, and become like the super team they, they, they're supposed to be. So let's just see, and hopefully that Tyrone makes, makes the right decision when he decided, because he's trying to take down this cop who killed his brother, but he's not going about it the right way. Yeah. Hope he gets his, his act together. Hopefully both, both get their act together, because they're starting to realize, because they, 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 they're not there yet, but they're they, they kind of realize that they, they need each other to pretty much survive and help them make it through. So, I think that's all I got to say about that, so give my channel a big old like and hit thumbs up. Oh yes, also, if you have been watching this, before that, leave your comments down below and let me know what you thought about this, these two episodes of, um, of Cloak and Dagger. If you have been watching, check it out for yourself, something I work for, hopefully you watch it, you will enjoy it, have fun watching it too. So give my channel a big like, hit the thumbs up, shabu, and subscribe to my channel, and share, I really appreciate it. Also hit the little bell, the bottom to notify every time I make a video. And if you are watching this video and you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I really would appreciate it. So, like I always say in my dreams and in my life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, peoples.